Alright. I don't know if you guys like Ronald McDonald's Chicken McNuggets, but I've been on a quest for a long time. Now, this is kind of old news for me, but I thought, thought I'd share it with you guys. I had done many, I mean many, types of different recipes to recreate McDonald's Chicken McNuggets. And, uh, some, you know, you, you see these things online and they're not even close. I mean, it doesn't come out even close. These people are, are out of their freaking minds. I don't know what McDonald's they're going to, but ain't no fucking McDonald's I ever seen Chicken McNuggets like the shit they're trying to say is Chicken McNuggets. But, as a matter of fact, after all this research, after all the time I spent trying to make a chicken McNugget. I mean, I ground up chicken. I, I cut chicken into little dinosaur looking fucking things and all this shit. It didn't fucking work. And the Walmart, the Walmart comes through. The Walmart had the shit down. They had the shit right in their freezer and I'm gonna show you it right now. Check this out. Pilgrim's Chicken Breast Nuggets. Tempura style. Let me tell you something. These are Walmart. Not in their fro frozen section, but in the section like one of them little floor freezers. Okay? If you want McDonald's Chicken McNuggets made at home, this is the closest damn thing you're going to find by Pilgrims. I am telling you, I worked my ass off trying to find something to make Chicken McNuggets. I did recipe after recipe. I bought this, I bought that. And it was sitting right there in the middle of the floor at Walmart. Thank you, Wally World. I'm going to put some of these in the air fryer and I'm going to show you. All right, first of all, I want to show you what they look like. These are what they look like. These things are frozen. I'm going to put them in the air fryer. And you're going to see magic happen. There we go. They're in there. It's like 11 or 12 of them. I think there's 11. I sprayed them down with a little bit of oil. The only reason I did that is so I could salt them. I put some salt on them. You want salt on them. Definitely got to put some salt on them. Now I'm going to shove them in that air fryer, and I don't even have to turn them over. Just let them run for about 12 minutes at 400 degrees. All right, look at that. Look at that, dudes. Ain't you talking perfect? Perfect. Here. Closest thing out there, I'm telling you. You won't be disappointed. Get them. Get them. See ya.